Alrighty, it is uh, March 12th. Yeah, that's right, March 12th. Sometimes I forget what day it is. Uh, it's 15 hours and 16 minutes. Right, that's the time. And if you're on a 24 hour clock, and I certainly am. And it's time for Comet X. Well, uh, this week is going to be uh, the second week of the new schedule. I tried out the new schedule yes, uh, last week, uh, doing the news at night and uh, doing Comet X in the, mor in the morning when I get up. So there's uh, two times a day you can see me. So rather than being posting, rather than uh, posting one video uh, to uh, YouTube a, a, a day, it's now two videos a day and soon it might be three or four uh, depending on how I schedule out the documentaries and of course the shorter comments why that's what I'm trying to figure out how to, what I'm going to do is that the comments why are going to be all my short replies well uh, I'm going to leave the comments X for the summaries and uh, uh, just sort of the the general the general overview of the day and the looking forward into what's going to what's going to happen uh, I'm also going to be doing the uh, talk about and shout outs in here uh, just because it's, it's it's more relaxed uh, I'm sitting on the couch and uh, you know just you know having a conversation with my friends on YouTube right so um, that's the way I decided to do things it's gonna be a bit of a challenge to get used to the new schedule uh, I also have to do some funding work this weekend. Uh, this week, uh, my funds uh, from last year are starting to run out, so it's time to hit the road the road again and see if I can bring in some new funds for this year. Uh, that's sort of <laughs> what was funny about I was watching uh, Cassandra's uh, uh, back on uh, on uh, her YouTube channel after her move, and it's just been about a week since she's moved, and things are starting to calm down. And she she feels like uh, her life is stagnating, and I saw that that uh, how tired she looked. And it's part I think that when you're doing something and you're in a high stress environment, you can handle things a lot better. You can push the adrenaline pushes you forward, and then as soon as you stop, it's like <laughs> you expect to keep moving forward that fast, but you're not. So when it happens. The speed you were before looked normal, so the slower speed that you were that that's supposedly normal now looks abnormal to you. It looks too slow, and that's sort of where she is now. And but as soon as she gets some extra sleep and kind of gets over her sleep deprivation, uh, she'll be back to more or less abnormal. I don't know if anyone's actually uh, has a normal life. I think most people have abnormal lives, so. You usually go back to your normal lab, normal. <laughs> Anyways, uh, what was I saying? Yeah, she was talking about uh, 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 wishing she could uh, do, do something more with her life. Uh, I think she's also concerned about uh, the money she's making because she, she's doing a lot of freelance work. And see, freelance work is 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 when you're a contractor or or, or, or when you have a, it's that's what self-employment. What she's going if you're watching her show, what she's going through is that's what self-employment is. Self-employment is there's no steady paycheck, there's no steady uh, um, income coming in. You always have to be going out looking for you know uh, money to come in to pay for things. This is the same thing is true here. Uh, I've been doing that now for about 20 years, going out and trying to find, every year, I have to find money to pay for my bills, uh, you know, for for the different research I'm doing here. Everything has to be paid for, so because you're not uh, uh, working for somebody else and you're not sucking at the government uh, tit, uh, you're not, you have to sort of fend for yourself. And because it's that way, it's not a continuous stream of money. You always have to keep replenishing it year after year. So there's a period of time where you usually can, you know, where you have to go out and sort of uh, get off uh, your, uh, 
get out of your comfort zone because I, I, you know I don't, I don't know how comfortable she is making money and, and asking for money from people but that's a, essentially what you have to do is that uh, as, uh, if you're going to keep doing the research uh, then you know, or whatever work you're going to be doing then at some point in time you have to get up from that work as enjoyable as it is and go out and do your homework which is uh, collecting the money to pay for your bills and so that's never an easy task uh, I'm sort of re re redoing how I do things so you'll see that sometime either t uh, tonight or tomorrow uh, I will put out a little advertisement on YouTube uh, uh, for my funding uh, then what else? What else? That we went by? I went by uh, right and proper ladies. Uh, everyone seemed to be doing okay uh, up until t I think it was Tuesday. Everything kind of dropped off. Tuesday or Wednesday, everything dropped off. And uh, yeah, yeah, Lindsay didn't show up, and Bethan didn't show up uh, uh, last week on uh, right and proper right and proper ladies. But I saw uh, Ellie's there. I was, Ellie's doing fine. She's still her happy-go-lucky self. And that's cool. Uh, that's, what, that's what I like. I, said, uh, I was talking to some other uh, YouTubers on... Uh, uh, as I was flipping around the channel. And uh, they were sort of asking people what they like to see on uh, YouTube. And I said, well, for me, it's, you know, I like seeing the room tours. I like seeing the different halls. I like... Uh, the vlogging videos, uh, I, I'm interested in seeing the person, and whether I stay or not really t depends on whether I like the person or not. You know, in terms of what I'm seeing from the personality, they don't have to do anything special. Just you know, uh, can you sort of th feel like you're you're watching or or participating in their lives or uh, I don't know. It's it's like kind of like good dialogue. I, 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 that's what I kind of like. I like. I don't want. You don't necessarily have to be singing or dancing or doing uh, any special videos. Uh, I prefer the uh, just seeing the person. You know, the person there. I mean, there was there was one girl. Uh, oh, I think she was in Michigan. She was a boat person. She had her sister and friend. Uh, Doing some of the vlogging for it, it was kind of a bit. They were, they were building, being silly, and you know they were being themselves on the uh, on YouTube. It was like sort of you. Were, it, it was kind of like you were hanging out with them. That's what it sort of like. Uh, that's the kind of thing that I like. Uh, anyway, um, it's um, I'm going to try to get my week started to now. This is what's going to happen today. The week begins today. Uh, well, I'm going to do a bit of the news. I have, I decided not to put out uh, the two uh, computer science shows, Ubuntu BSD, Unix SL, and Cyborgs and Cybernex for for last week. I'm going to do it this week. Uh, change up. I'm changing up how I'm doing the scheduling to do the shows. Uh, so I can fit more work in. That's the whole thing. Is I got to fit more work in. Before I was sort of just leaving things and just sort of letting things go. But now I got to sort of schedule things in more because of the workload. So and yes, last week I was just getting used to doing the news. So this week uh, I'm still going to be getting used to doing the news, uh, which keeps me up until like four or five o'clock in the morning. So my whole, s the way I scheduled my day had to shift over and I wasn't able to get all the work in last week that I was supposed to do this week so I have to sort of reschedule things out uh, in order to uh, uh, get everything out that I need to get out. So that's the way things are going uh, are gonna to be and I think what will happen is that things will be touch and go until s season one, there'll be a lot of sort of gaps and uh, goose and <laughs> everything else along the way because this is sort of the, the season zero is always um, the test season. 
and when you come to Comets X, because now there's uh, there's one more channel coming up this week, uh, also related to to my physics. Uh, it's going to be an economics channel. Uh, for those of you who don't, don't know, uh, physicists do a lot of something they call dynamic modeling, and that dynamic modeling can be applied to almost anything, including economics. And so this is uh, the economics that I have been working on for the last few years and did a couple tests for it you know, in terms of test runs and see how things worked out and they, things work, seem to work okay. So I'm going to be working on bringing the next month or so, I'm going to work on bringing back uh, my economics channel. I should post the channel sometime today. Uh, it will come up on my f on on the on the main YouTube channel, and I will also for all the different channels a lot of the background discussion on what I'm going to be doing is going to be occurring in Comets X. So Comets X uh, on Big Bang Theory is the background feeder for it, all the channels. Uh, if you want to see behind the scenes, you want to see what's coming up on any of the channels, uh, it will be here. Uh, in uh, Big Bang Theory, com uh, uh, Big Bang Theory RL's Comets X, Comets Y uh, is now going to be my short replies. Uh, I'm going to try to keep them to about six minutes in length. Then uh, the Omega construct, I haven't forgot about that yet. That is now going to become a documentary series. So the Omega construct is now is, is which was Comets. Uh, under Big Bang Theory uh, is now becoming a documentary uh, under two channels. It's going to be under uh, the Space Program API and then under the Bass Institute channel. Those two channels will handle the development of the Omega Construct. Then once the Omega Construct starts producing episodes it will appear on Physics TV. Uh, the Bass Institute will initially start off producing the uh, documentary on, mis uh, on Mysteries in the Library. Uh, that's the tentative title so far. I have a couple other titles I'm going to try out. And until I got the titling straight, the episodes will be under the Bass under the Bass Institute channel. Once the tiles and everything's worked out, and I've got a good schedule for the filming, all documentary series will then be uh, uh, pushed onto the Physics TV channel. Physics TV will be the normal channel for all sort of production. Everything will sort of all the shows and docs will, will the documentaries will will appear on Physics TV as a regular series. So a lot of the behind the scenes the testing will be on the side channels. Uh, Physics TV will be the main output channel. Uh, Big Bang Theory out is going to be behind the scenes and sort of where everything is kind of pulled together. So that's the layout for the channels uh, that the way it is right now. Uh, and for those of you who want, uh, don't forget, look on my feed. Uh, I will be posting comments. Well, not any comments. You can follow what I'm doing on 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 Cyborgs and Cy you know on, on my on my main channel. And then for those of you who want to keep following me, uh, what you do is I'll post a comment. Uh, I'll, I'll tweet it actually, and I'll post it onto the onto the thing there, onto the uh, the comments feed that I'm. What channel I'm moving to? So let's say I'm going to do work on the Bash channel, uh, Bash Institute channel. I'll put uh, moving to do work on the Bash Institute channel. You've already seen this to a certain degree uh, when I went to do the news. It, you'll see around 11 o'clock. You'll see leaving to do the news, and that means I'm on the news channel. Uh, even though the uh, headline news broadcast won't come out until around one o'clock in the morning, because so I have to wait for I have to wait for for the news. I have to wait for the entire day's events to finish. So usually, I get to the 
filming or uh, the taping or filming or whatever you want to call it around uh, 1230 in the morning uh, it's about a half hour in length so I finish it at one it takes about another half hour to an hour for the video to process so uh, it's typically live about, about two o'clock in the morning so two o'clock in the morning uh, the news is live you can watch it the following day and because it's now titled headlines and beyond it goes further into depth uh, into the day's headlines than you would normally see on an average news broadcast so if you want if you're interested in geopolitics you want to see find out what's going on on the news uh, then IE9 is the channel for you, and this broadcast is one of the broadcasts. You sh this is sort of your, your your bread and butter, and then the documentaries that will be coming into the news channel on INN uh, will be uh, sort of filling in a lot of the answers that we're sort of sh showing showing uh, on uh, on that channel. So, anyways, uh, I'm going to leave that. Th leave it at this for now uh, we'll see how the day goes and how it progresses and I'll talk to you tomorrow on comments X or I'll see you later on the news